Taupo town, or city as we like to call it, is basically located dead centre of the, the North Island of New Zealand. The lake water is a major source of water not only just for this town but for all the towns from here to Auckland. In 1994 Taupo moved to a land disposal system where the water is irrigated to farmland. We're required to dispose of the waste um, basically outside of the lake catchment area. Uh, to make sure that the nitrogen in particular doesn't leach down through the soil and end up back in the lake. By bringing the treated effluent to a site like this at View Road, we're able to grow in excess of a million dollars worth of grass a year. Instead of all that nutrient just being wasted or tipped into the river, we're actually utilising it to the benefit of everybody. We've always seen that we need automation, uh, we need to have that remote control ability. Uh, we, not only do we have this site, but we have a number of wastewater treatment sites spread all around the lake. None of those are permanently manned, they're all controlled remotely from the main wastewater treatment plant through automation. The Allen Bradley equipment is extremely important to us because it, it allows us to control the assets from a remote location. Um, so it keeps our operating costs, our human labour costs down. I and mean, one of the advantages that had been in this recent upgrade to FT View as a major automation platform has been our ability to install standards that we know that are up there with anywhere else uh, in the world. In 2008, we put another 135 hectares under pivot irrigators. They are more reliable, more efficient, uh, more easy to control, more easy to control the application rate. With the sophistication of the equipment, we are able to remotely access our system, do changes uh, remotely, and more importantly, changes can be done from this Auckland office. The most important person for us have been your systems integrators. Most people view him as an employee uh, because he probably knows as much about the functionality and the workings of the, of the process uh, as anybody within the council does. So that knowledge is of great benefit to TDC. We're uh, sited in a very aggressive area in the sense of the geothermal and the effect that that can have on equipment. It is very important that we have longevity in equipment. It's important that the equipment can stand up to the environment without breaking down. We need instant backup. If we have a failure, we need to be able to get hold of somebody and have them respond instantly. In the event that we need to get support from somewhere else within the NHP family, we know that they will be able to assist us because we can't afford to have failures. The assistance that NHP is able to give us and tell us where you're going in the future uh, helps us plan for the future. The relationship that we've been able to develop with NHP through the service that they have given us, being able to have a direct point of contact at a senior level, uh, has given us a degree of comfort. The speed at which NHP react as far as the supply of equipment and their attention to resolving any problems that may have occurred you know, has been appreciated and is once again is most important.